He's not religious. He's divorced. <laughs> you yes. mean Camelot? Yes. Oh, I didn't know. What? How do you not know this? Yeah. I, I, uh, I don't research like... people. I think so it's weird. kind of weird to be so like, weird. I want you to tell me organically. I Googled you. Oh. I was like, X-ray girl nude. And it, there was nothing on there. So I was like, well, <laughs> fuck it. I guess I'll just read her summary. <laughs> That's what you do. Oh my god! Me. Okay, I will say this. So I was at Chrissy Mayer's wedding, and the table I was at was like the only fans girl table. <laughs> yeah, dude. I love that because we had like um, Zia. Uh, I think there was a girl that was supposed to be there. She wasn't. Gigi was at the table as well, and I don't think this one girl was. But she was she was beautiful enough too. If she wanted to, she'd do very well in there. Um, yeah. yeah. And so there you go. <laughs> yeah, no. See, when I had Zia on, that was the first thing I did. I was like Zia nude on Google. I was like, I'm like, we did, did something this. pop up? Yeah. Including yourself? No. Oh, what? okay. I'm surprised. <laughs> I have no videos with Zia. I mean, I would. I mean, if she was like, "Hey, bro, you want to shoot a like a like a like a four minute thing?" I'd be like, "Yeah, dude. Fuck it." You can even show my face. I don't care. Oh what, are they gonna do? what are they going to do? Oh, Camelot's a degenerate. He was the balls deep in the uh, OnlyFans girl. Yeah, that's literally what I would do. That's my that's my character. I would do that. Mm-hmm. Because that's me. I would definitely do that. <laughs> it's come on. That's, that's I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. <laughs> dude, dude, uh, uh, now, no, look, no offense. I love white girls. Love them. Something about them. They're just, ugh, they're like trailer parky. I love trailer park girls. Oh my- yeah. you know it's funny so uh, when i dated i had this like i read this story about this doctor that inseminated these women it was like in the uk or something with his own sperm then thinking that it was you know someone else's and then you know years later these two find out they're like half siblings Whoa. that they're dating oh my god so anyways he got in trouble my fear is if i date an asian guy they're gonna end up being my family yeah, this y'all is a legitimate the, fear. Y'all all look the exact same. <laughs> How would you be able to tell? You know, right? Like, I, just, like, like would you be able to tell? Oh, uh, we're probably related. You know, look at this. You know, yeah. That's <laughs> so that's all I'm saying. No, um, yeah, dude, it's 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 wild. I, it's something about trailer parky, like white girls, like I feel like it's Asian. Thing. They're always like rich and stuff. So like that's too, that's out of my class already. Like they're they they're above me, you know. I can't. I, you know what I'm saying? They're too rich. They're too high class. Says the man who eats beef jerky. I heard that's really expensive. In this the is, somebody PO box my ass is. Oh. I don't buy things. I buy like <laughs> smart stuff and then immediately break it. <laughs> trailer park. It's the trailer park in me. Like that's what you do. You know, you buy, you buy stuff, you half ass put it together, and then it explodes. What I do. Well, um, <laughs> yeah. Well, okay. <laughs> I feel like there's many things in your life that you've probably done that with, including yeah. human beings. Yeah. Oh, I've broken a lot of women. And it's their fault. It's their dumb faults. They'll be like, hey, I like you. And I'm like, hey, you're cool too. And they'll be like, we should hang out. I'm like, all right, cool. But let me preface this hangout with I'm not interested in being with you in any kind of way other than like <laughs> national <laughs> sisters. Right. Okay, you emotionally broke them. <laughs> you made you basically. I'm, I'm like, look, girl, I love, I love, you know, women. I'm, I, fr- I like friends, uh, but I don't do relationships. And they're like, oh, I'm okay with that. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. They're they lying like, to themselves. Yeah, they they think they're going to be the one to change it because every yeah. girl thinks they're the like the greatest. They're, they're yeah. the the game changer. Yeah, so they always think that shit. And they're always like, they're like, oh my God, he says he's not into relationships, but like for real, uh, I'm this so funny. I'm a so comedy, funny. Yeah. A I'm romantic so, comedy. I'm so, I'm so funny and my personality is crazy. <laughs> like no one's ever met anyone like they say, everybody says I'm just the craziest. So I'm going to go over there and he's going to be like, wow, I've never met a girl that watches Netflix and drinks wine. This is crazy. And then <laughs> she comes over and then I smash a pistol yeah. and then she did it and I'm done. And I'm like, and why are you not talking to me anymore? I'm like, because we did the thing. And now I'm moving on to another white girl that watches Netflix and drinks wine. And they're like, oh, how could you? And I'm like, bitch, I told you. And they're like, oh, I can't believe it. That, that, that's was- the funny thing with dating. People just, uh, some girls I know, they just don't, 
they don't listen and they think I'm going to read in between the lines and think he's so emotionally damaged. I'm going to listen to him and make him feel better and then be happier with me. I'm going to be no. the first one that changes everything. No, bitch. I've been through a hundred y'all asses. You ain't changing me. <laughs> I said I didn't want a relationship. Yeah. What's that to me? <laughs> yeah. That's like a bait and switch. Like I say, it's 1999 and then they get there and they think it's going to be like, and then I'm like, oh, it's 50 now. And they're like, what? What the fuck? You said, that? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, bruh. <laughs> 